hey everybody, welcome back to Phantasma Hall. Today's episode, we explained the entire FNAF lore using paint. So, uh, oh my gosh! Insane! Here's how it starts. The, um, there's a purple guy, and he's uh, sad because he knows one day he's going to die and life is meaningless. But uh, he gets an idea. Oh. And he decides that if he kills a bunch of innocent children, uh -huh. he can learn about immortality. Uh -huh. So he kills the children and puts uh -huh. them in <laughs> animal suits and sees how that helps with immortality, because, you know, immortality <laughs> stuff. And, uh, makes sense. Makes sense, right. And... That did not work out very well for Mr. Purple Man when the kids' souls went into the suits because they tried to kill Purple Man and Purple Man was sad. Mm -hmm. And then uh, I think he hides in one of the animatronic suits, Mr. Purple Man. But uh, he ends up dying in the suit for some reason. Like... So the children's souls go in the suit no, and squish him. Shut up! <laughs> um, and, uh, but before that, wait, no, I'm doing this right. And then there's FNAF 1, where you're a security guard and the animatronics think you're Purple Man, but you're only Purple Man's son. So uh, you're sitting at your desk. And then there's FNAF 2, where you play as, like, phone guy or something. I, I've never actually... I don't know what FNAF 2 looks like. I, I have no <laughs> clue. But, uh, stuff happens in that one. I don't know. FNAF 3 is about, like, spring trap coming to kill him, and he's the only one who can hurt you. Because he, he... He's mad because he's immortal now. Mm -hmm. He wants to just be a kid. And so he tries to kill you with his, like, henchmen of animatronics. And, uh, but that doesn't work. And then FNAF 4, what's, oh yeah, FNAF 4, you're, like, the kid. And, um, and he's been to jail before, you can tell, because he has, like, the jail shirt, the stripes on it. And he escaped from jail. And he's hiding in his house now, and his dad doesn't want him going to juniors, and uh, mm -hmm. so he scares him with the animatronics, and um, that works. But now he's a terrified little child who yep. uh, ends up being known as Crying Kid. Nobody likes a baby. Um, and that's why his older brother fed him to Freddy Fazbear into Freddy Fazbear's mouth, you know? Uh... Mm -hmm. His older brother just couldn't take it. Right. Like, quit being such a baby, you know? And I, I, mm -hmm. I, I understand that. Then there's sister location, which is like underground. And, um, there's the girl animatronics, but they don't have children's souls in them. They just want to kill for some reason. There's, like, the weird ballerina one, and then there's, like, the baby that does have a soul in her, and she's just, like, salty or something. And so, she decides that she wants to put you in the scooper, scooping room for some reason. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, uh. And then there's custom night. You see, custom night... You choose which animatronics you want. You want Bunny? You got it. You want Freddy? You got it. You want Baby? You got it. And then, uh, you fight them all. Because, um, with the desk and the doors and stuff. And this is Michael Afton, the purple man, being in hell. And, uh, he's forever oh tormented gosh. by these animatronics in hell. And then there's FNAF World, and nobody cares about FNAF World, because it's just stupid. And, uh, so don't play that game, it's stupid. 
Um, I think that's all of them. Okay, bye.